going on guys welcome back to another video I know it's been a little while I've been busy working on the server keeping it going trying to make it one of the best servers we about the we got the beekeeper mod installed um, about to put the files in here pretty soon so players can start using it it's going to be a how-to guide now some of the things might not be relevant to other servers as far as selling on trader things like that but regarding the crafting part it will be the same I'm only going to do the honey I'm not going to do the wine uh, haven't made it to that one yet I'll do a wine video later on uh, for the purpose of the way the mod is for the wine it's probably not going to be able to be sold on the trader and I want this mod as an activity for players to be able to make money at it like I have other activities on the server alright let's get to this move my head up and down here alright so the bee suit first thing alright you are required to wear the hat at least an NBC suit does the same thing as this so you can wear an NBC suit and you won't get any cuts the bees will sting you and give you cuts so if you just put just this on and without the mask you're still gonna get cuts so you gotta have this the rest of the suit or NBC suit but the mass stays the same. Okay? Alright, let's get started. Alright, first thing you do is place a kit. Now on this server you're going to be able to buy it on the trader and find it in the world. Alright. There we go. That's the first step. All right. Let's see, to craft the honeycomb frames, it's ten nails and three wooden planks. All right. We're just gonna craft one. I'll show you. Oops. Wrong one. Wrong one. Derp. Derp. There we go. Okay. One honeycomb frame. This is what catches the honey. Alright. Oh look, dinner is served. <laughs> Alright. So, normally you just place it in there. This is the first step. Okay, you'd place three in there. Now, I don't have... There's no file for this, so you can change the settings, but it takes an hour to fill three of them. So, for the purpose of this video, we're going to pull this one out, pretend like it already filled up three, okay? And you can see they change color when they're full. Oh, one second. Oh, somebody killed the dark horde. Interesting. Alright. Let's get this thing out of the way over here. Alright, so now that you got that in there, the honey pot, you can see it's already disinfected, but you have to disinfect it with alcohol tincture. Just simply put it over it and combine and it will disinfect it. It already is though. Alright, we're going to throw it over here. Alright, now since these are done move one here. You can see it's right there. Take your spatula get an option 
get honeycomb. And it's slow. Alright, and then it gives you one back. You can always place it back in there if you want. It gives you a honeycomb. You can put honeycomb in these slots right here. Alright, we're going to do the same thing. You got to do it three times in order to fill the pot full. One more. Drop it in the second slot. Winds pick it up. Better not rain. Alright, finally. Now we got three. We'll just put these back in here. Also wanted to add, yes, you can open this. Doesn't seem to make a difference of anything, honestly. Alright. Obviously it triggered the sound of the bees. Probably a bug. Alright, next step. Now take the this away. Take the pot that's disinfected. Take this. Alright, let me do something. It tends to bug if I'm next to it too much. Yeah, no, it's gonna have to work. Alright. Add honeycomb. Yeah, this is exactly what it does. Let's do this. There we go. Can't do it straight from the inventory. I just forgot. Alright. Now we've got a honeycomb pot. Put it right there. Alright. Now take the dipper. Make honey. Now this server, this is worth 10k. And you will not be selling this pot this way. Otherwise you're going to have to find another one or buy another one. There's not an empty version of this pot for the mod yet. It is a new mod. Give the guy time and uh, I'm sure he'll make some changes up on it accordingly. Maybe speed things up a little. That would be great. Don't you think? <laughs> Alright. Now we have a full pot of honey. Alright. We're at 10k. 10k, buddy. Alright. Now, since we don't want to go to Trader and sell this, because we won't have a pot to make our next batch, that's the key. You can do this. Take a empty honey glass, which you can buy from the trader very cheap or find in the world. Combine. Whether you can pour it also, you know how like you pour other things, probably it's quicker this way. So. 
Okay, now you see you got a jar of honey. So this will fill five jars of honey. All right. Um, and then my trader, they're going to be 2k a piece, so it'll be 10k. All right. There'll be just a little bit left in here after five. There's not much you can do about it. All right, give me a second here. I want to make sure I go over the other step. Okay. Let's get to this. Let me jar. These will you will be able to find on the map here. Um, not for sale. I'm going to empty this one. This, what I'm about to show you, is just if you want it for personal use. Okay. In the mod, it says uh, boost your immune system. I would imagine it does the same thing as a vitamin. Cannot confirm that, but, you know. Take the empty jar. Ah, let you pour. Okay, if you combine it. Now this one you can probably definitely do the pour option. Set one on the ground, pour above. It sounded like I was going to the bathroom. Alright. <laughs> now, you can see, let's get this thing out of the way see it didn't quite fill it because we had already taken some out of it so when this is full it will all of it will go in here now as you can see if I eat it bottom right you get the pill thing there which means it's boosting my immune system all right The wine, again, I'm not going to go over the crafting of it. It's a bit more difficult. You can do the same thing. You can drink it. All right. I just wanted to show you that that was part of the mod. Okay. Now, for you guys that are on my server, the only problem with this mod is there's no class name, two class names for this being full and empty. So the only way to get an empty pot is to buy it at Trader and it has to be 10k because otherwise you could just make a ton of profit. It's going to come full of honey. But what I am going to do is I'm going to put a donation barrel full of these up there and I'm going to keep trying to fill it up. You can also find it in the world, turn it into these, and make 10k. So I did do both. I didn't make it sparingly in the world. You jokers would be rich. <laughs> you already are. Alright. What else? I think that's it, guys. One and that's pretty much it. That's all there is to this mod. Not much to it. Put your honeycombs there. That's your test tube for doing the thing. And that's, you know, for all this stuff over here. Um, this will stay in the world on this map because I'll max out the lifetime, of course. Um, this won't be the biggest moneymaker. The Cannabis Plus on our map will be the biggest. And then our hunting, uh, we sell pelts, meats. You can make money doing that too, selling guns, of course. But this one is going to be good for setting these in there. It's going to take about an hour, and I have no control over that. And you can go do something else. Build base, go loot something, come back. So it's more or less pastime money. And it really doesn't take that long to put it all together. It seems confusing, but it's actually pretty simple. And it, so far, is working really well for a new mod. I typically do not mess with new mods at all. 
Okay. I appreciate you guys watching. Like and subscribe. It'd be helpful. I'm still five month old channel. Maybe going on six months. It's doing pretty well. If you guys are interested in the server, I'll put a name of the server in the description of this video. Um, got a good group. It's grown pretty dramatically lately. You can see we got 19 on right now. It's not a big server, but again, it's only it's the same time as my YouTube. It's nine, uh, five months in. We go between 10 up to 30. It's a 30 slot server. I'll move it to 40 once we get to that point. For all you guys that are playing on the server, thank you for watching the videos and everything y'all do. We got a real good group here. We don't have nasty people. And as you can see, it's got a mod in it. So we got PvP in the red zones. Got a black market up there. These are all PvP zones. Heli crash site. Um, we got drops, airdrops, all that good stuff. Everything else is PvE. Great server for a new person or a person that never got into PvP. Because you can roam around here, do what you want to do, and when you're ready to go play, you got places to go. I'm actually going to increase these. I'm thinking about making some of this PvP up here too to give more options because I've got about six or seven places I would say. Alright, I'm rambling on. I talk a lot. Okay? Okay? <laughs> Appreciate you guys watching and one more thing for you guys on the server. I'll have a in Discord, I will have a text document going over the same thing. So you have all the info you need to make all the money you want. Alright, appreciate it. Later.